Hey guys, in this video today, I'm going to show you how to edit kind of some HTML to change things like a logo and text and buttons and images. So uh, we'll get to that. Before we begin, if you're not already on my newsletter, make sure you go to chasediamond.com backslash newsletter. Again, no A in diamond, so it's C-H-A-S-E-D-I-M-O-N-D.com backslash newsletter. Go here to start, and then all you have to do is enter your first name and your email. And then you will be, you'll be able to see a button to click join. So if you're not ready on my list, go do that. Uh, but other than that, let's get started. So um, this was an email that I showed you guys uh, on Twitter. If you're following me on Twitter, um, but I'm going to teach you guys kind of how you can create one like this too. And I'll provide the codes that you can use. So if you follow these steps, all you have to do is swap things in and out. But in Clayview, if we go here to source, I'm just going to copy this source file. Um, I use a tool called CodePen.io. Um, I've got no affiliation with them. I'm sure there's other platforms out there to do the same thing. It's just one that I found recently that I like. So I'm going to type in the HTML over here. And then um, you can see down here, right, that you know, this is the email that we're looking at. Um, so let's start at the top. We're going to start with changing the logo. So I'm going to right click and grab the image address. Then I'm going to do a control F so to find where that image is. So um, you can see this is where it's pulled. Um, let's find an image for something. Um, you know, it's almost lunchtime for me, right? So let's say something like, I don't know, pizza. Um, Domino's popped up. Let's go Domino's logo. I want to do a transparent background. So we'll go over here to images. Um, I don't think that has a transparent background. Let's see. Okay, so let's grab this one. So what we need to do is right click and then copy image address. And then we'll just literally swap. Um, we'll just swap this in and out. Um, probably an easier just way to do that, but we'll just make sure that this, right? So. That's all gone. Let's paste this in. And so now Domino's logo is up here. Um, you can play, you can change things like the font size or the color or the width. Um, you know, if we want to make that any bigger. That looks a little bit bigger. So that's how you change the logo. If you want to change the text, let's look for where it says welcome. So we'll do control find and we'll look at welcome. All right, so it's a welcome. Welcome to Domino's. And so you could change it to be whatever you want. It says welcome to Domino's. Um, and then if we wanted to, you know, move anything like this, right? We could change uh, different areas. Let's see if this is the right one. Right, so I changed that to the center just by changing it from left to center. Um, now let's look for where it says I'm stoked, right? It should be right below. Right, so I'm stoked to have you here. All right, we could change this to I'm stoked. You're interested in our pizzas. Right, so that will change this and I'm stoked you're interested in our pizza, pizzas. Again, right, so we're looking at here at the text, you've come to the right place to learn email marketing. We could just change this to come to the right place to eat great food. All right, so eat great food. Every Monday, I share a sort of content, right? We'll say I share um, discounts on our pizza and food, stay tuned. So that has, um, all this has changed. Now for the button, look at where it says start here. Um, we could just change this to something like order now. Right, that will change the button, order now. And then if we want to change this image, again, we just need to copy image address, let's search for it, found it. And here we want um, say pizza from Domino's. 
I butchered that. Okay, let's just grab the image address. Um, so we'll delete the photo of me. Put this. I should, if we did it right, show a pizza, right? So again, super, super simple. And now what we want to do, right, if we want this to um, be the new image here, all we have to do is just paste that in, save, right? Welcome to Don.